something very nice. It's a breakthrough for many diseases. And I'm happy it happened. It might have been in the market for 20 years, but we know fairly recently. And um, it's a wonderful medical miracle. I'm happy I'm doing it here. Advantages, there are so many things to tell about uh, umbilical cord blood you know, banking. Because um, there were certain diseases which cannot be cured at all. And people were frustrated to spend money and to see for matching. Now, umbilical cords are the basal, 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 basal stem cells. It's loaded with stem cells. That is, um, like you want to make a brick, you get the clay. From clay, you can make any variety of bricks. No? But same like that, these stem cells are the basic embryonic stem cells and they are loaded, the umbilical cord is loaded with it and they can be banked and kept for any number of years, 10 years, 100 years, wherever they go, they change themselves to do, suppose it is a heart disease, kidney, pancreas, neurological, anything bland, it changes itself and cures wherever the disease is. So that's the best thing, a miracle discovered by the medical group. And this umbilical cord blood which you have thrown for years to years and years, the whole world could have had the adult, the basic stem cells. And uh, we have been throwing it, discarding because it's a waste product. We throw the placenta and the umbilical cord with the blood is thrown out. And whatever has to go to the baby is gone, the baby is disconnected and this byproduct we is wasted. But we are getting a medic medical miracle out of it. And you can cure your own baby, God forbid, I want the baby to be healthy. But suppose there is leukemia or something, the blood can be used for the same child. And if you want to help somebody and you are not using it, you can donate it to anybody you want. Now almost the awareness is becoming so well spread that we have started almost every alternate day, we start collecting the umbilical cord blood cells. Especially so because I am doing the test tube babies and most of the children born here are very, very precious. You may say even your child is precious, of course I agree. So you don't want your child to suffer from any disease. I pray for that. But in case, if there is some leukemia or something like that, you don't have to be frustrated, don't have to go anywhere abroad. You don't have to spend lots of money. You have it right in your hand, especially so that it has become affordable and you have bank loan for it and you have the EMI. What more do you want? So don't you think you should store your child's cord blood cell? It's not going to cost you anything extra and it's always going to be useful. And if you are not going to use it, you can donate it to somebody who is needy of it. Okay? Because it's going to cure so many diseases, especially cancer, uh, cyclical leukemia. Any, they are trying experimenting on autism, which is becoming very common now. And or anything cerebral palsy, any spinal cord disease, especially in adult Alzheimer's.